Hey folks, old guy here, out of the kitchen and back at Taco Bell already because they have started their decades menu. So they've gone from, I think, the 60s to the 90s and brought one item each back. So the first one is a tostada. Let's just take a look at that. There's the tostada. Lettuce. Uh, beans, red sauce, and cheese. Let's uh, kind of throw that back on there a little bit. Let's see. And the tostada is a two dollars and nineteen cents. The green burrito, which I think is this one, is a uh, dollar eighty-nine. The mexi melt, which I believe is this one, is uh, two ninety-nine. And the beef gordita is also $2.99. So, does it taste like it used to? Yep. Let's find out. <laughs> Let's find out. They got plenty of sauce on there. I don't know if you can see that. Either that or it's just all on one side, which would be my guess. Here we go. Well, right away I noticed that the uh, corn tortilla is really, really thin. Taste-wise, I think it's close to what it used to be. They did change their red sauce, but this does kind of remind me of their old tostada. So I'm gonna wait to give my rating on that. I'm gonna get through the rest of it. Let's see here what this one is. I think this one might be the gordita. I have no idea. I don't remember what comes in, but I'm going to take a bite and find out. This must be the green burrito. It doesn't say on the wrap, so. The green burrito is just beans, green sauce, and cheese. Mm. I'm tasting mostly beans and cheese. I'm not really getting a lot, a lot of flavor out of the green sauce. I'm getting another bite out of it. Okay. A little more taste of that green sauce on that bite. Yeah, I don't think it tastes anything like their old green sauce. It has a different flavor. It's more vinegary than it used to be. Yeah, it just doesn't seem as flavorful. Mm. So, <clears throat> again, don't need judgment on that until I'm done. This, <laughs> well... I thought it was the uh, green burrito. I was wrong. So, up oh, this one must be the gordita. I can see actually see some beef in that one. Hmm. Maybe the Mexi belt. Mm hmm. It's the ch three cheeses. <clears throat> I think. Uh, Swiss, mozzarella, and cheddar, I think, along with their green, green beef. <laughs> oh, it's not green. <laughs> their ground beef. <laughs> That's okay. Tastes 
tastes pretty much like I remember. All right. So now we're going to move on to the last and final item, which is the Gordita Supreme. And you can see lettuce, tomato, the ground beef, no sauce. Of course, there's cheese. Let's see. Yeah, it just, it tastes a lot like the Mexi Melt, only you're getting the addition of the lettuce and tomato. Uh, the three of these have little to no sauce. The green burrito had some. It wasn't, it wasn't as much as I would have liked. And the uh, tostada, the sauce was all on one side instead of... It, it's nothing special and I don't really like have any fond memories of a, a gordita. This isn't bad, uh, but I don't, you know, I would have probably picked something else to bring back, but that's me and not Taco Bell. So <laughs> all in all, it's not too bad. Mm, the price for the uh, bean tostada was a bit much as far as I'm concerned. Uh, $2.19 for a tostada with some beans on it. It seems a bit much, but that being said, I'm going to give the whole thing as an overall rating with about a, mm, I'm going to be generous and give them a five out of 10 old man grunts. You <laughs> know, <laughs> I'll see you the next time I'm out of the kitchen. Bye-bye. <laughs>